Lord of the Sun and today I am going to perform a science activity in which I will produce hydrogen gas. So how will I do it? First I will put this aluminium foil into this bottle and then I will put this caustic soda which is of white color. It is also called sodium hydroxide or NaOH and it is its crystal form. Then we will put it into this and then we will put some uh, water into this bottle. So then it will produce hydrogen gas. So how we will test it? So we have matchstick for it. We will light it and put it on the top of this bottle. So what will happen? It will burn it with a uh, slight pop sound. So why it produces a pop sound? Because it is a very unique feature in hydrogen gas that whenever it is burnt, so it produces a pop sound. So let's do an experiment. So let's put this aluminium foil. And I am also telling you that uh, this reaction will be exothermic reaction. So please perform it in, under adult supervision and also wear some gloves. So I am putting this aluminium foil into this bottle. So now I am going to put some caustic soda, a small amount of it. So I have put some caustic soda in it. Now I am going to put uh, some water in it. And now I am going to shake it. I am shaking it and you can see some gas is also produced so I am did you see that pop sound so that was only the presence of hydrogen after I did this experiment one more time so you can see how the aluminium foil is boiling and fire is also produced and after that when it blows out uh, water vapor is also there and the mixture becomes whole black in color. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Madhav Dushan and today I am going to perform an experiment in which I will prove that oxygen is needed for combustion. So for that we need matchsticks, we need water with a utensil and we need a candle and we need a bottle and why i have mixed color in the water that i will tell you when i will prove that oxygen is needed for combustion so first perform this activity first i will light this candle so our candle is lighted so now I will put this glass bottle over it. So now did you see that our candle is blown out and also you can see the uh, level of water is still here. But in the bottle it has increased till here. So did you see that the water of level rose in this and the candle also blew off in a few seconds. So why did this happen? This happened because we cut off the oxygen supply that was outside and uh, now the uh, candle is not getting any oxygen. It has only a limited amount of oxygen which is used in a few seconds. So now it has blown up. And you will ask that why is the water, uh, why is the level of water increased? So it is increased because uh, there is not only oxygen in, in this environment. There are other gases also. If you will see the composition of air, there are, uh, that is divided into three parts. So first one is 78% nitrogen, then comes 21% oxygen and the rest 1% that is 
remaining consists of carbon dioxide, uh, water vapor, dust and uh, many other gases. So uh, the oxygen is now finished. So uh, to take place of the oxygen, the water rose to this level, from this level. So that is why the water rose. Thank you.